Hi everybody, it's Joe Masseri from NSC Windows. One of the most common questions I get is for people to ask me to compare the quality, appearance, and functionality of the Anderson 400 series versus the Marvin Elevate series, which used to be known as Integrity. Let's start by talking about the materials that are used to build the windows. First, the Anderson 400 series, which uses four different materials. The interior is wood, while the exterior consists of wood sashes coated with a Flexicron urethane paint finish, a vinyl cladding, and a Fibrex sill, which is made of wood fibers and recycled vinyl. Now, the Marvin Elevate only uses two materials a wood interior and an exterior made from fiberglass material called Ultrax. Right. Ultrax is not an ordinary fiberglass that you might be more familiar with, like say a Corvette or a boat hull. Those products are sprayed. Ultrax is actually a continuous fiber material. It's called pultrusion. It gives it much more strength. Then also regarding the durability, Ultrax is not painted. It's actually an acrylic finish over the fiberglass, so it's an extremely durable finish as well. So while both windows have wood interiors, the exteriors are actually vastly different. The Marvin Elevate uses the one pultruded fiberglass exterior, while the Anderson 400 series actually uses three materials. Now that could become important because the three materials are going to actually expand and contract at different rates from each other, so it can cause gap issues later on. The Marvin Elevate uses only one material for its exterior, the Ultrax fiberglass. The fiberglass material is actually silica based, the glass and fiberglass, just like the glass is. So what that means is that the expansion and contraction is very, very minimal and very, very similar. So there's not a lot of back and forth motion which can be detrimental to the performance of a window. So because of this, gaps are much less likely to form. Leakage issues are basically non-existent. So the differences in the exterior materials are going to have an effect on the overall exterior appearance of both windows. As you can see, the 400 series vinyl clad wood frame, putty corners, as opposed to fiberglass frame, mitered corners. Much cleaner look on the Marvin Elevate than the Anderson 400 series. Let's talk about how the three different materials on the Anderson 400 series affects the overall appearance. You have vinyl clad, you have Flexicron paint, you had Fibrex, we talked about that. Now what does that mean? You're gonna have three different materials that all fade at different rates. So very important when it comes to darker colors especially. Now, the Marvin Elevate, again, the one material. Also, remember I mentioned before, it's not a painted material, it's an acrylic finish. So that means that fading is kept to a bare minimum, even in the very darkest colors. The Ultrex has fantastic color retention properties. Marvin does a good job of giving an example of a red tail light on a junked car that could be 30, 40 years old. A little spit polish to the red and the acrylic red comes right back out and almost looks brand new. Same thing applies to the pultruded fiberglass on the Marvin Elevate. Now let's talk about the ease of cleaning the windows. First, we'll start with the Anderson 400 series. What you're going to do is you're going to unlock the window, open it several inches, then you have these wedges that are up in the jams, and you're going to bring them down on each side, press, and then it spreads the jam out and you're able to grab the window and pull it in. Now the top is done a little differently, you're going to have to slide those wedges up out of the way, and then you're going to just basically pull the window in without using the wedges at all. Not the greatest thing, hasn't been changed in many, many years, but it does you will allow you to clean the windows from inside the home. Now we're going to talk about cleaning the windows from the inside on the Marvin Elevate. Same procedure, you're going to unlock the window, slide the window up several inches, but now one of the key differences is here, you have tilt latches. What you're going to do is you're going to pull the tabs in towards each other, and the window is just going to simple, simply tilt in for cleaning. You're going to bring this down, same latches, similar latches I should say, on the top, and you're going to tilt that down, and now you're able to clean the windows from inside the home. 
When you're done, you're gonna just simply rotate them back into position, pull the tabs in, then you're gonna bring this one up, pull the tabs in, close, and lock your window. So I hope you enjoyed this comparison between the two windows. I finally answered the question that everyone asked me. I want you to be able to make a good educated decision for what window best uh, suit your needs. Now, in the comments, if you want to see us make any other comparisons, whether it's with Anderson, Marvin, or even any other windows, if we have access to them, we'd be happy to do it. Just leave it in the comments below. Thanks so much for watching. We hope you enjoyed it.